everybody, Oregon Motorcycle back. Today, um, we're installing a radiator grill on the CB500X. It's gonna go right up in here. Uh, it's a good idea to use these so you're not uh, letting a rock or stick get up in this vulnerable area that's exposed right here on the front of the bike. So um, it's a good, cheap upgrade. Some of them cost more than others. I ended up going with just a cheap Amazon one. Uh, so in this video, we're gonna find out exactly what it takes to install this. Um, if you guys read the reviews, you will see that it is a little bit of a tight fit for the 2019. Uh, may or may not require some modification. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, yeah. Oh, you guys wanna see a sneak peek of something real quick? Ta-da, look what's in the shed. That's a full on race bike right there. We just picked that up a couple days ago. More on that later. Anyways. Package within a package. Looks small, says made in China. There it is, it's tiny. Let's go down and mock it up, see what it's like. So our milk goes up there, so yeah. Rip this plastic off, looks like we're gonna take these two bolts out here. I've never done one on this bike before, but this looks pretty straightforward. Take that out, and then whatever there's in the center. Okay, this looks like we gotta take, come on there, focus, there we go. Looks like we gotta take this bolt out right there on top, this top center of the radiator. So I'm gonna take this out, and these two out on the bottom. And I bet we'll be able to install. This looks like a pretty easy install. So basically, Looks like it's just gonna slide in between there on the top there where that bolt came out and then just bolts up here probably on the inside of that though but first i'm gonna this radiator is really dirty as you can see how much abuse it gets right in this area this is pretty thin so it's gonna prevent rocks and sticks from getting up in there it seems pretty pretty decent for what i paid for i'm gonna put a link down below in the description if you guys are interested in purchasing this uh, i'm gonna spray this out first before i install this and then uh, go from there. a tight fit. It's kind of under pressure when it's in there. So it's fitting in between the edges of the radiator here. So it's almost kind of like it's got a bow. Let's push this little top tab down. Looks like that'll go in there. All right, so you can see I got the bolt started in here. It's kind of hard to film up in here and my camera thing keeps falling, so. so that's not that hard to get in. So I'm gonna tighten that up. And then down here, these plastic trim pieces now are not like wanting to flush up. I mean, I could just put the bolt back in there and it might be okay. Maybe that's the way it's supposed to be. I was thinking if not, you could trim the, you could trim a little bit of the plastic off here, but. I don't really want to do that. I think I'm just going to put the bolts in and call it a day. All right, so I got each bolt started. One, two, three, and the one up here, they're, they're just started. So whenever you guys are doing something like this, just remember to get everything in and started before you snug any one of them up. Now that I got all three of them, I'm going to go ahead and start snugging these up and getting them tightened down. And we'll take a look at how it fits overall. not bad I mean for the price I paid for it, I'm pretty happy with it um, it is a little tight like the reviews say 
Um, so you can see like, see there's a little gap here on top, right? Which I don't, it's not gonna be a big deal, but basically it's kind of like, it's bowed a little bit. So it fits in like the little notch right here on the radiator that comes out. So it's got a really firm fit in between there. So you just kind of, you know, bow it out a little bit and it go, goes in there. All the holes aligned like perfectly. I put all the bolts in with my fingers. So that's good. And um, so yeah, the fit's a little bit off. The finish is on par for, you know, a cheaper China product. And uh, overall, I'm uh, pretty happy with it. Pretty happy. So now I got some extra protection on the radiator grill. It actually looks a lot better than, than stock. Uh, than just having nothing there so really digging it so yeah picked up this little icon tank bag today too uh so yeah more on that later i'm gonna do a, a video on my luggage uh, and that's gonna be coming up pretty soon guys so i'm um, still working on that video from the coast it's just taking forever oh my gosh i think it might be a really long video but i'm still working on it so if you guys are liking the videos hit that subscribe button hit that like button and uh let me know how I'm doing. Look at my license plate. Oregon motorcycle. Yeah. All right, guys. Till next time. Late.